In an interview yesterday at Inoro FM and Citizen TV, Rafael Tuju has released another bombshell that is likely to make William Samoy Ruto lose a lot of votes from Mount Kenya. According to Rafael Tuju, he said yesterday that William Samoy Ruto did not support Uhuru Kenyatta willingly. He was paid billions of money to support Uhuru Kenyatta. He has evidence and he said that if he is called in court to provide evidence, he has them. In an interview at Citizen TV yesterday, Rafael Tuju said that they had to conduct a fundraising so that they can give money to William Samuel Ruto in order to support Uhuru Kenyatta. So, what he means here is that when William Samuel Ruto is moving around Kenya, around Mount Kenya, saying that he supported Uhuru Kenyatta, and this time he wants Mount Kenya to support him, is a lie. He was paid to support Uhuru Kenyatta, and, and in that he was able to provide 2 million votes from Rifty Valley. Before we go deep to the discussion of this video, just in case you're here for the first time, and if not subscribed to my YouTube channel, kindly take a second or two, subscribe, and put on the notification bell, so that every time I upload a new video, YouTube will automatically notify you. And for the returning subscribers, thank you very much for always coming to support the content of this channel. This far, it's because of your great support. Let's now go deep to the discussion. As I've said yesterday, Rafael Tuchu had two interviews, Inoro FM and Citizen TV. He maintained the statement he gave at Inoro FM saying that William Samoy Ruto was paid billions of money to support President Uhuru Kenyatta. He said they sent a video in 2015 where William Samoy Ruto said is worth 100 million Kenyan shillings in 2015. But how comes William Samoy Ruto is a billionaire by doing businesses in Western, Western, Western Hotel uh, and other businesses he mentioned during an interview? He said that William was paid billions of money and they conducted a fun drive that helped President Huru Kenyatta to pay William Samoy Ruto in 2013 and 2017 to support him. So, here, politically, when you look at this statement, it's clear that William Samoy Ruto was to come out 2017 and contest as a president. But because of the money they gave him to support President Uhuru Kenyatta, he had to decide to be a running mate for President Uhuru Kenyatta. Now, in this, you can ask yourself a question that what happened President Uhuru Kenyatta right now is not supporting uh, William Samuel Ruto? This question, you can answer it by saying that if President Uhuru Kenyatta paid William Samuel Ruto in 2017 and 2013, uh, uh, William Ruto was unable to pay back President Uhuru Kenyatta so that he can give him the support from Mount Kenya. Now the differences between Uhuru Kenyatta and uh, William Samoy Ruto might come from that fact that uh, Rafael Tuju said yesterday. 
There's something against sensitive Raphael Duchu said that if it happens, William Samoy Ruto to become the president of Kenya comes August 9th, then it means him and the DCI Kinoti will move out of Kenya to look for a country where they can be uh, to avoid being arrested or being harassed by William Samoy Ruto. It means that in Jubilee government, there are so many things happen. They don't want to disclose to Kenyans so that they can know exactly what happened between President Uhuru Kenyatta and William Samoy Ruto. Now this statement raised by Raphael Tuju, what impact is going to create in Mount Kenya? So many people in Mount Kenya right now are reacting to William Samoy Ruto saying that they have to pay back his support to President Uhuru Kenyatta. Now, if Uhuru Kenyatta paid William Samoy Ruto, then it means now Mount Kenya are free to support any person they are willing. Now the narrative that Yango Kumi Nayake Kumi is no longer existing in Mount Kenya because of the money William Samoy Ruto was given. I have been wondering why those rich people from Mount Kenya are not supporting William Samoy Ruto. And they are now supporting Raila Morodinga and they are giving him money to drive his campaign. Now the money is the key factor here that led Jubilee to, di to differ with President Huru Kenyatta and the other leaders in Jubilee. Right now, President Uru Kenyatta is out campaigning for Raila Morodinga. That one is going to anger William Samoy Ruto and is going to release other things that Kenyans never knew about President Uru Kenyatta and uh, him. There are other leaders who are founder of Jubilee who are working with uh, William Samoy Ruto and others are working with Uhuru Kenyatta. If these leaders happen, they have come together and they are campaigning for one person, they must differ in so many things. Those are the reasons I've seen that could have made William Samoy Ruto not to be supported by Uhuru Kenyatta. And that's what I had in this short analysis. Thank you for watching this video.